the underground has largely been absorbed by the mainstream. I mean, now RuPaul has a her own TV show, and it's, it's everywhere. The internet changed the face of everything. So I'm gratified to see the world that I fought for and celebrated become just part of the atmosphere everywhere, everywhere you go. Does it soften the blow, though? Does what soften the blow? The fact that you now know that you pioneered something and that that has come to fruition, that sense of acceptance, that culture of acceptance. I mean, we're here. We're on the other side of it. I mean, millennials will never understand the fights that you went through to get us to this point. People will not understand that this was not always the way that people wrote about what was once considered a subculture, part of the city that we didn't talk about. So the fact that you are now on what is increasingly the other side of that divide, does that Soften the fact that you're no longer writing for the place that allowed you to do that. Or at least give you a sense of closure. It does give you a great feeling to have people come out and say, you pioneer things, you change things. But everybody wants to be in the moment and relevant right now, and that's what I want to be. I don't want to be like Lauren Bacall walking around people, oh, you're an icon. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, I want to be employed, not an icon, and that's what I'm going to be. So I'm going to still be making waves and challenging people.